If you've been wanting to check out the Mauna Loa eruption, you may have missed your chance. Scientists say both volcanic eruptions on Hawaii Island have come to a pause. KITV4's Aali Iduklo has the latest on Mauna Loa and Kilauea. The U.S. Geological Survey Tuesday downgrading the Mauna Loa eruption from a watch to an advisory level. We don't expect it to resume um, based on historical analogs for other rift eruptions of Mauna Loa. Um, none of them have ever paused during the eruption. USGS also reporting the Kilauea eruption is now also lowered to an advisory level. Experts suspect it was dwindling before Mauna Loa began erupting. Oh, uh, what's the old Holland Oltz song? She's gone. Um, there is no discernible glow from Kilauea, and yesterday during an overflight, um, couldn't see any um, red lava on the ground. Volcano observers will monitor the eruptions for another three months or so before officially declaring it over. Meantime, Hawaii County officials will be scaling back the designated viewing route. The site will close at midnight. It will open at 4 Wednesday afternoon, then close again at midnight. That will be Thursday's schedule as well, until closing for good at midnight. The interest and the number of people coming to those sites has waned so much. Police will be maintaining a presence in the area, also continuing with our traffic enforcement, especially during the uh, busy holiday season. Mauna Loa Access Road remains closed because of the potential hazards from the lava there. The Gilbert Kahele Recreation Area will be open around the clock for the public to view Mauna Loa. Aali Iduklo, KITV4 Island News.